my name is John Church. I'm the bursar here at Pembroke College and I was also the project director for the college's new build project. Our new build project started seven years ago with a feasibility study uh, and we then identified the opportunity of extending the college into a nearby site. As we did the feasibility study we realised that we could put more onto the site and we could actually add new facilities to the very traditional old ones we have in our college. Uh, a theatre, a cafe, seminar rooms and a whole range of other facilities. And at an early stage we decided that we needed some project management support and that's where Bidwells came in. I'm Nick Pettit, head of the project management team within uh, Bidwells. Uh, today you find us in Pembroke College in Oxford. So we were appointed in early 2010 uh, with the planning application going in shortly afterwards and concluded on site in October 2012. We wanted to put the first priority as being the student bedrooms. So we've got 96 ensuite student bedrooms and we have six flats for graduate students. We then felt we needed a large meeting room, a, a substantial room, a prestigious room, and we called the, that became the Harold Lee Room after the donor. The bridge was really crucial because having acquired the site and knowing we could put something meaningful on the site, when we then wanted to have a mix of facilities, it was really important that that should be an extension of the main college and not the annex. So having the bridge was absolutely vital to making that possible. The bridge itself was a major challenge because it's in a conservation area, it has to go over the medieval city wall which is a, a scheduled ancient monument, uh, it's surrounded by listed buildings and so we did have to engage very early with obviously the architect's help with English Heritage and the local conservation officer to make sure they were comfortable with the bridge that would, it would sit well in, in its setting. Uh, a, a deliberately rusted structure uh, together with the glass sides. It's very tasteful, it blends in very well and we're delighted with it both aesthetically and of course the way that it links the old site with the new. Uh, the, the challenges were not uh, insubstantial on the project. The site had significant archaeological artefacts in the ground. We also then found a, a, a gas main. It wasn't known by the local authority and was in very poor condition. The local authority insisted that we remove, relocate the gas pipe and this necessitated us changing all the feeds to the local residents. Uh, there are always many challenges in a project of this nature and it was a very complex project on a confined site, very ambitious uh, architectural design. But Bidwells uh, found their feet very quickly in the project and they played a full part in many different ways. I've enjoyed my working relationship with Nick Pettit and Dan Carter. That's worked really well for us, so absolutely I would recommend them again. <laughs>